Hi guys and welcome to TechBased. In this video we're going to talk about the new gallery section in the file explorer in the dev channel of Windows 11. The latest build which is the build 23430. Yesterday we talked about the improved details pane that Microsoft is working on on the dev channel. But Microsoft is also improving the gallery section and in this video I'm going to show you how the gallery section looks and what they added to improve it in this build. If you enjoy videos like these please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the TechBased channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. So let's begin with the video. First of all, as always, you're gonna have to set a Vive tool on your computer if you haven't done that. Just download the latest version.zip. Of course, you're gonna have the download link in the article below in the video description, and you can just open it up using File Explorer. Click on Extract All, click on Browse, and make sure to extract it into the System32 location in this PC, Local Disk C, Windows, and then just Locate System32, select Folder, Extract. In my case, I'm gonna have to replace the files, click on Continue, and Vive tool should be set up on the computer. It's really simple and fast. Now all you have to do is to open up the CMD and click on run as administrator. On user account control, of course, click on yes. In the CMD, you're going to have to paste only one command, which includes all the IDs necessary to enable this new gallery section in the file explorer. So you're going to have this command in the article below in the video description. You can just copy and paste it from there. And of course, a huge thank you to Phantom Ocean 3 for discovering these IDs and helping the community find these hidden IDs faster. You can follow him on his Twitter from the link in the pinned comment below. Just press enter, you should receive the message successfully set feature configuration, and then you can just exit out from the CMD. After you exit out from the CMD, make sure to restart your computer for the changes to take effect. Now after the restart, we can open up the file explorer. I'm also gonna enable the new details pane, and we're gonna go into the new gallery section from the left side. And as you can see, this is how the new gallery section looks along with the new details pane. I think this looks pretty nice as you can see it is a little bit more reliable it looks nice in my opinion and of course you we have also this slider which is chronologically categorized but as for improvements regarding the new gallery section, we have this new drop down here, which says manage gallery contents and resources. And if you click on it, you're going to notice that you have certain areas of the system that you can see pictures or photos from. We have pictures, documents and downloads show all together if we want that. And of course, we have the manage locations button where we can manage where we want to see those location. As you can see, we have here pictures, documents and downloads because I added these locations here. You can just add one by clicking on add and selecting your location or you can remove one by selecting it and then clicking on remove of course this is not working 100 percent properly because as you can see it is a bit delayed once you add or remove something you're gonna have to wait a bit until that option will be added or removed inside this drop down but overall i think microsoft is doing a great job and this new gallery section looks very very nice as always if you want to disable this new gallery section you can just use the same command but with slash disable instead of slash enable you're we're also going to have this command in the article below in the video's description. So this is it. This is the new gallery section with the new drop down and the new settings. I think it's looking pretty good. Let me know in the comments below what you think about it. And if you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the TechBase channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. Don't forget that the download link revive tool and also the commands used in this video will be in the article below in the video's description. I was Emmanuel from TechBase. Until next time, have a nice day.